curious about something. You've done a lot of movie work, uh, but are you mostly recognized as Newman? Do most people see you that way? Yes, I'm afraid. Uh, well, that's good. You know, there's nothing wrong with it. Um, it it's just that uh, I'm now kind of cornering the market on schleps and weasels. <laughs> I, uh, I either play a, a, a dumb schlep or a nasty weasel, or sometimes a nasty schlep or a dumb weasel. <laughs> it's your specialty, but there's a perk with this, though, I would think. You're becoming quite hot. These films you've been in are successful. Seinfeld, of course, successful. People uh, have a lot of fun with your character. You must get invited to really cool celebrity events now. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, I just did a... <laughs> Uh -huh. Just the other night, I was, uh, you know, they were opening that big Warner Brothers store, mm -hmm. uh, you know, and I'm in Space Jam, so they, you know, invited me over to observe the merchandise, mm -hmm. which, uh, you know, there's a lot of. Mm -hmm. And um, so, you know, they have the uh, red carpet and the paparazzi, and they've got, like, bleachers on the other side with people going, ah, you know, to Michael. Nobody uh, did that to me, but... Um, <laughs> Just so, cricket noises yeah, when you yeah, came yeah. past. All right. So uh, <laughs> I, I go in there, you know, and we go down the carpet, and people want the autographs, and we're, and mm -hmm. we're all kind of hobnobbing together and sipping uh, little beverages and uh, having little hot dogs or whatever. And uh, there's Patrick Stewart, and he's... Uh, from Star from Trek, Star The Next Trek. Generation. Yes. And, of course, other work. And many other things <laughs> yeah. from long ago and mm -hmm. far beyond. Mm -hmm. um, so um, I'm standing there with uh, two of the animators, and he comes over, and we're chatting, and I'm feeling very... <laughs> and he uh, looks at me and says, uh, Are you one of the animators? And I said, uh, No, I I I'm an actor. He says, Oh, really? And looked at me somewhat doubtfully. Mm -hmm. I said, uh, no, I'm on, you know, I'm, I'm uh, on Seinfeld a lot. He says, that's odd. That's my favorite show. <laughs> what? And yet I don't recognize it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. God. But still, you got invited. Yeah. You got to see the merchandise, which yeah, was fun. Yeah, it was really nice stuff. Yeah. <laughs> which you're not allowed to touch. No. Yeah. As Space Jam, tell us about that. Uh, this thing is a, a huge success. Was it, was it fun, uh, fun being in this movie? Uh, well, you know, it's kind of like being in your room. Uh, I mean, you're alone, mm -hmm. and, uh, and uh, there are a bunch of people wearing green stuff, and it's a big green stage. And oh, technically, you mean? They have to kind of, of course, the animated stuff is done later. So you're yeah. acting to almost, you're, you're acting to no one. Really. Acting to no one. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, and that's kind of nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've been in some, uh, you know. Did you like, uh, did you like actually, uh, you, you're working all, all these great athletes in the movie, too. Did you like doing that? Well, I was, uh, you know, I, we, I did this one scene where uh, I look up and uh, there's Michael and uh, Patrick Ewing and, uh, you know, Sean Bradley and Larry Johnson and Charles Barkley and Muggsy, Muggsy Bogues. And I'm thinking, uh, what is wrong with this picture? Uh, <laughs> where's Waldo? You know, I mean, uh, uh, <laughs> Oh, no, Wayne. I look like one of those little yogurt raisins, you know, I'm <laughs> yeah. just kind of standing there. <laughs> did you, uh, did you, I, I know that, uh, you know, things are going well for you now, but when you were first getting started in your career, you did some Broadway work, yeah. which actually, uh, you were working on a show where it was, it was a little tough to get people into the seats, wasn't well, it? Well, I mean, uh, I, I did the show uh, Gemini um, for three years. Mm -hmm. So, you know, in the beginning, it's a small house. <laughs> you, you're filling, you're filling the house and you're feeling great. And, uh, and then as time goes on, it begins to thin out, you know, so uh, they were using a, you see the bus and tunnel crowd come in, you know, and people mm -hmm. talk back to the uh, stage and uh, people getting up to get a drink in the middle of the act, you know, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, one night we're, we're doing the scene where uh, we're having dinner. We have this big scene where everybody has the spaghetti dinner and they serve out of this big spaghetti bowl and uh, there's a woman in the front row and she yells out, uh, do you want a piece of cheese? <laughs> and, uh, That's the oddest heckle I've ever heard. Yeah. That was kind of strange. Uh, uh -huh. And so we, we, we kind of, the first time, you just kind of get a little flinch and you kind of take a, a light peek and you go on. Uh, and she came down to the edge of the stage with a, a bag and said, Do you want a piece of cheese? <laughs> the guy playing the father looked at her and he's giving her one of those get the hell out of here lady <laughs> looks, you know. And she didn't kind of take to it and said, uh, Here! Hey, have a piece of cheese. And she reaches in her bag, grabs a piece of cheese, and hurls it on the stage. It lands in the spaghetti bowl, and the audience just goes, Wah! you know. They loved it. They loved it. They thought it was like part of the festival. The critic you know? wrote, this show has been reworked beautifully. We love the cheese. You know? Live interaction with real cheese. Yeah. Four stars out of four. Oh, oh hey. What the hell what was that? What the ding dong heck? Big piece of cheese. Everybody okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's the right. cheese yeah, lady. Yeah, someone cheat through cheese. Cheese. Yeah. Cheese. Uh, but uh, the uh, stage manager went out to her, you know, after the uh, 
after the show, or at the intermission, and said, uh, please, you know, leave the actors alone. Don't interfere with them. She said, uh, was I interfering? He said, yeah, you know, I think throwing a piece of cheese on stage, I would <laughs> count that as minor interference. That qualifies, you know? yeah. She says, I'm sorry. <laughs> and it turned out that um, the first eight rows of the house were uh, supplied from a mental hospital. Uh, oh, my that, God. Um, well, it was, you know, it was either that or one night you look out and there's just all sailors' uniforms, so you get a kind of idea that something's going on, you know. <laughs> Uh, a ship just pulled into town. Yeah, what do we go see? Let's go see that Broadway show. I hear they throw cheese around. That's right. It's great. Free let me, cheese. Let me make sure I mention this. Uh, Space Jam is, uh, is, of course, out there at theaters now everywhere. Seinfeld, like I need to plug this, but Thursdays at 9 on NBC. All right, Wayne, thanks so much for coming on Thanksgiving. Thank Above and beyond the Call of Duty. Thank you very much. Wayne Knight, everybody. We'll take a break. We'll be right back.